out. And three, two, one, pop! <laughs> Pretty cool, right? You can try it too if you... Pretty good at this. You guys are working way too hard. You're always looking to one up us, aren't you? Temple. Yeah, points for Ivor, I guess. This was a good tip. Well, Jesse? So, are we doing this? Order of the Stone, it's time to get some glory. For, for glory! glory! I know we all yelled glory out there, but... I'm not gonna lie to you, I was hoping for treasure. Come on, you know how these places work. The treasure's never just out in the open. Let's fan out and search the place. Huh, these channels lead to the center of the room. They look like they're designed to let lava flow from those channels in the wall. Why would you want to do that? Hi, Petra. This place is cool. Knew you'd find it. So, how are you feeling lately? Wither sickness free. I think. Now I'm just trying to get used to having teammates and people who worry about me. That's pretty new for me. It's nice, though. So how do you think Ivor knew about this place? Eh, who knows? That guy's read, like, a million books and traveled all over the world. You probably start to learn a thing or two about a thing or two. Any thoughts on this place? I think I'd rather be in a straight fight than doing all this switch-pulling stuff. But I'm glad Ivor's intel about this place was good. Okay. I'm going to keep trying to solve this. Yeah? Any ideas for how to fix this? Well, these channels of lava are blocked in strategic locations by those sticky pistons. Unblock them, and I'm guessing something cool will happen. So, what kind of treasure do you hope we find in here? Well, I've been working on a build that could use another couple dispensers. But some cocoa beans would be cool, too. So, have you been having a good time hunting for treasure? If you had asked me a couple of months ago, I would never have thought I would like all this adventuring and treasure hunting stuff. But this has actually been a really good time. And I've been getting lots of great stuff to build with. Okay. I'm gonna figure this out. Never doubted you for a minute. again. Hey, Axel. What you need, buddy? Axel, what do you think of the situation? Um, I don't know about the situation. I kind of do more 
blowing stuff up? So, if you need someone to do stuff like that, I'm totally your guy. So, what kind of loot you think we're going to find in here? Oh man, well, I want to make a room with an emerald floor, right? Who doesn't? I'm like four emeralds away, so getting some emeralds would be pretty sweet. Man, we have the best adventures, don't we? Yeah, it's pretty sweet. I was worried I wouldn't be cool enough or smart enough or whatever enough to be in the Order of the Stone. Thanks for always believing in me, buddy. Psh, you know it. Okay, I'm going to keep working on this. Sounds good, dude. Never mind. I would have been disappointed if the floor didn't open up into a dark, creepy passageway. This kind of reminds me of when we first found the Order's Temple. We were such a scared bunch of noobs back then. Wow, yeah. That feels like it was, I don't know, a million years ago. We've packed a lot in since then. And to think, that was just the beginning. Yeah. That was before we'd fought wither storms, hung out with Enderman, reunited the Order. So crazy. Bingo! All right, let's see what we've got. Concerning taste, Jesse. I respect that. Hmm, a pumpkin. Not bad. Huh, I suppose that could be useful if we run into Enderman. And looks like we've got one more thing in here. It's What did you find? What are you guys talking about? Whoa! That's super cool. I've never seen flint and steel like that before. It's enchanted, it's rare. And now, it belongs to Jesse. Ha! Oh, ho, oh, oh, ho, that's so cool. You gotta try it out. Okay, flint and steel, do your thing. Whoa! Well, I have definitely never seen a flint and steel do that before. 
Uh-oh. Looks like some monsters have a death wish. So what's the plan? If you ask me, it seems like a good time for a secret handshake. Yeah, so let's use the redstone wrap. Obviously. Uh, I think you mean the warrior whip? Obviously. Warrior whip! Go! Come on, Jesse. Make it good. Just like we practiced. You guys, that was amazing! Okay, okay. It wasn't bad. here I tell you guys doing that never gets old Woo! yeah not too bad killing a bunch of monsters getting sweet treasure like that flint and steel thing you got to try it again I'd be curious to see it again too I'm dying to know how it works okay what should I burn first the grass no that stump Well, well. Where'd you get the new toy? <laughs> Looks a little, uh, sophisticated for you, Jesse. Order of the losers. Yeah, losers. Ugh, who let you guys out of your cave? Je Sorry, but who are you again? Oh, I get it. The Order of the Stone is so fancy that they don't even recognize us anymore. Even though we used to wipe the floors with you guys every building competition. So what are you ocelots doing here anyway? The ocelots were Lucas's gang. We ditched that name just like we ditched him. Yeah, we rebranded. We're the Blaze Rods now. Blaze Rods! Shut up, Gil. Sorry, boss. Don't do it again. Wow, you guys are terrible at naming. That's a dumb name. <laughs> says the heroes that just called their group the New Order of the Stone. And where's Lucas, huh? The minute the Order decided you were cool... For whatever reason... He wouldn't stop sniffing around you like a tame dog. You take that back! Hmm, no. Hey, Lucas is ten times the guy you are. Yeah, Lucas is a hero. 
Which is more than I can say for any of you, Kreese. You probably think that thing makes you so special. Classic Jesse. You take all the best stuff and never give anyone else a chance. That should have been ours. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Blaze Rod. There's no shame in being second-rate, Aiden. Not everyone can do what the Order of the Stone can. <laughs> well, that's, that's just what I expect from someone as small-minded as you, Jesse. Hand over the flint and steel, Jesse. Don't make me ask again. You don't get that one. It's supposed to be mine. Haven't you taken enough? Some hero you are, Jesse. Fine. What hope do we have when heroes like you are throwing your weight around like this? It's not always going to be this way, though. Come on, you guys. Let's get out of here. Blaze rods! Ooh, told you to shut up! Look out, Jesse. I don't remember him being that angry before. That was... disturbing. We should be careful. He seems... different. Scarier. Man, and all because he wanted that flint and steel. What are you gonna do with it? Ivor's the one that told us about this temple. He might know something about it. Hopefully, Ivor can tell us more about it. Finally starting to recognize stuff again. Feels good to almost be home. Cheers to that, friend. I just can't shake what Aiden was saying about us back there. We do get a lot of treasure. And I guess sometimes we might throw our weight around. What? No. Aiden's got a bad case of treasure envy, pure and simple. I don't know. Yeah, not our fault we're so awesome. I guess so. Well, no matter what Aiden thinks, there's one thing I know. What's that? They think we're awesome. They're back! You guys, they're back! Run! Tell everyone that our heroes have returned! <laughs> yep, New Order of the Stone is back in town. adventure full of monsters, hidden temples, treasure. Oh, I can't take it anymore. Ah! You guys are awesome! Welcome back! Well, uh, maybe next time. <laughs> Happy to see us scream. Wow, that's new. It somehow manages to evoke skulls and tentacles. Uh, that thing looks completely dangerous. Eh, not my fault! Look out! Oh, uh, help! Oh, stop your whining! What are your pathetic injuries in comparison to my majestic tower? Ivor? <sighs> of course. Oh, Jesse, you're back! Don't listen to a word these fools tell you. It's a fire hazard! And your face is an ugly hazard! Causing trouble again? Nothing. Just a little spirited debate with the local community. 
brain function is proving difficult for them. You need to remove this now! Jesse, all I wanted was what any man wants. A little house of my own, with loads of lava pouring off it. Ivor, I know you mean well, but your house wants to kill people. Dude, you made a killer house. Exactly! Killer! Shut up! What about just moving it someplace else? I'm sure that- Move it? Way more lava is going to spill out if we do that. Well, we have to tear it down. We can't let that monstrosity stand. It's my house, Jesse. I have just as much a right to build something as all these people, don't I? They're just jealous that I've got vision. Well, they've got, they've got community planning. Blech. Ivor obviously put a lot of work into his new house, and we need to show it the same respect that we would show a house not dripping with lava. Leave it. I'm sure we can find a way to work around it, okay? Long live my lava house. Long live lava! Thanks, Jesse! That's right. Keep walking. Keep walking! Always nice to see a gracious winner. Ha uh, ha! Uh, haven't seen you around in a while. So what can I do for you, Jesse? We just got back from that temple you told us about. The one in the jungle? What? You did? <laughs> yes! Great to see you again! Let's do lunch! I'll bring the carrots! There's no telling who's listening. Meet me in the treasure room. Ten minutes. And bring the thing you found! Well, if we're going to keep that thing up, we should at least encase the lava in some glass to make it safer. But, like, not too safe. Come on, help me collect some sand, and you can make sure that when we make it into glass, it's the right amount of safe. Okay. We'll catch up with you later. Yeah, once we make sure this art gets the respect it deserves. Nice work today, guys. Yeah, not bad, right? Mm, it's like we should do this more often or something. Later, guys! Come on, let's go find Ivor. Wow, this place is really shaping up. guys you have some pretty cool stuff in here crazy stuff <laughs> yeah no doubt hey Lucas great to see you it's been a while I really missed you guys well, we missed you too and you have so many other treasures boy you have sure been busy oh wow you framed it I'm him yeah how are you doing I really, really miss him. Every morning I wake up and just for a minute, I can pretend that he's just in another room or rooting around outside looking for carrots. And then every morning, I get to remember all over that he's gone. I'm so sorry. <sighs> okay, guys. I promise I wasn't just here to bum everybody out. I actually came back because I need to tell you something. It's about this weird run-in I had with Aiden. Ugh, I hate that guy. Whatever you said or did, it really got to him. Uh-huh, we saw him too. The Order of the Stone and the Blaze Rods are just as friendly as ever. That's an understatement. He's just been so jealous of you and the rest of the Order ever since you saved the world from the Witherstorm. He's convinced that he was supposed to be a hero. Ever since he took over the Ocelot and the Blaze Rods, it just seems like he's gotten meaner. He's pushing Maya and Gil around. I'm warning you, Jesse. 
Don't ignore him. So what'd you find that got Aiden so excited, anyway? Check it out. Wow. What a weird glow. Yeah, I know. I'm supposed to show it to- You found it! No! Whoa! Dude! What is wrong with you? This is the greatest find of our time. I can't believe you're actually- I mean, it's got some sort of enchantment on it, but it's just a flint and steel, right? Jesse. That's not just some sort of enchantment. That glow, that enchantment, is the work of a very old group of builders. A group so old that they existed even before the Order of the Stone. Whoa. Yeah. Dramatic. Wow. I didn't know there was a time before the Order of the Stone. It's incredible, isn't it? I haven't even gotten to the best part. You see, if these builders truly existed, and if you found their temple, that means we're one step closer to finding the Eversource. What a beautiful sight. Looks like you came back just in time, Lucas. The Ever what now? The Eversource. Are you, uh, gonna actually explain it any more than that? The Eversource is said to be an object of incredible power possessed by the old builders. It was some sort of treasure or artifact that gave them an endless supply of precious materials. Think about it, Jesse. That temple must have been its hiding place. Wow, old builders? You learn something new every day. Okay, so this flint and steel might have this old builder enchantment, but how do you know that's where this Eversource thing is? I've traveled near and far, Jesse, and that temple, that flint and steel, is the only firm proof that I've ever seen of the old builders. That does seem like a pretty good bet. Old builders, Eversources, ancient mysteries. You know I'm in. Excellent! I'll pack my adventuring things immediately! Wait, he's coming? Wow, sounds like you guys have a lot to get to. I, uh, guess I'll take off? Nope, you're coming with. I need a buffer between me and Ivor. Let's get moving. <laughs> Adventure! Lucas, I know it's daytime, but watch our backs, okay? I can't believe we're bringing Ivor with us. I mean, it's nice that he's so excited, but... Ugh, not my top choice for adventuring companion. Ah, uh, come on. He's super funny. And he makes me laugh. I guess... These trees are enormous! I love it so much! <sighs> he just... Really gets on my nerves sometimes. Remarkable. Look at this architecture. So old. So exquisite. Oh, this is just how I dreamed it would be. Except for less cake. My dreams usually involve cake. Ivor, it's nice to see you smiling. I'm not smiling. Wow. It looks so different during the day. Okay, but careful what you touch. There could be traps everywhere. Petra, blonde guy, are you two as excited as I am? I'm not sure that's possible. Huh, it doesn't look like those lava channels work anymore. I can't believe we missed some sort of secret area here last night. Eh, uh, we were kind of fighting, oh, a ton of monsters. It's not surprising that we didn't hit every single nook and cranny. You look excited, Ivor. Excited? I'm ecstatic, thrilled, overjoyed. The Eversource could finally be within my grasp! Once, uh, once we find it, that is. Pretty cool temple, right? Yeah, it's amazing. 
Not gonna lie to you, Jesse. I'm pretty excited to be along for the ride on this one. Well, that wasn't there last night. That looks promising. I'm heading up. Fantastic! We'll follow right behind you. Uh, yeah. What he said. So you think this Eversource thing is up here? Hard to say, Jesse. As the story goes, the old builders feared its potential. So they hid it away in a place where it would never be found. And ha! It never has been! What is Jesse doing up there? Well, that looks promising. Jesse, what do you see? <gasps> Some kind of portal? It's just as I'd imagined. That's a weird looking portal. Have you seen anything like it before? No, the old builders experimented with portals, but this is different from anything I've seen. Here goes nothing. Oh, thanks for bringing this back to me, Jesse. I knew you were good for something. That thing is way bigger and more powerful than you could understand, Aiden. Give it back! Says the person who just got knocked trying to light it. Step aside, Jesse. We're heading through that portal now. Oh, no way! Aiden, you're done. This is where it ends. Fine. Blaze rods! Clear me a path. We've got to follow them. If they get the Eversource, who knows what trouble they'll cause. We're going after Aiden, and we're going to take him down. for my height. Thank you very much. There you go. Easy now. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Definitely don't want to fall down there. It would seem, Jesse, that stepping through that portal has brought us to a world almost, but not quite, like our own. Now we just need to figure out where the Eversource is. Ivor was right about this being another world. I'm liking you better by the minute, Louie. Wow. It looks like some kind of city? That's incredible. That's it! That's where it must be! The Eversource. A city in the clouds. It almost sounds impossible. I just don't know how we're gonna reach it. Yeah, that's definitely gonna be a problem. I can't believe this. We fall through a portal into another world, and then we can't even go anywhere. Can't we just, like, build our way over? Uh, how? Oh, please! 
You've heard of a bridge, haven't you? I don't know. Seems like a long way. Do we have enough blocks? I mean, it's really, really far. Yes. Very astute, Lucas. Ivor the Grump strikes again, I see. If we strip this whole island down to nothing, it might just be enough. Stop pushing! I'm not pushing! Lucas is pushing! I'm just trying to keep away from the edge! It's all edge! Okay, gang. I think that should do it. Let's make ourselves a bridge. Excellent! Okay, this is our stop. Everybody off. Ivor, seriously? <laughs> Sorry, can't help myself. You're building. I, you, I, I, I don't. Hey, yeah, we're building. Is something wrong with that? I, uh, uh you don't know? You, 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 you were building. Uh, unauthorized building is against the law. Wait, there's a law saying people can't build? Yes, it's forbidden. This, this makes no sense. No sense. Okay, I'll bite. Why is building against the law? Oh, uh, it, this is making me terribly nervous, but uh, first those other outsiders, now you. Other outsiders? Where are they? Uh, 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 they went to the inn. I I'm sorry, but that's all I know. Wait, wait, wait! I'm come back! Matthew, sorry! And he's gone. <sighs> Darn. I wonder if everyone here is that... ...nervous. <laughs> wow. Incredible. Wow. That is absolutely beautiful. Yes. Clearly the Eversource is capable of miraculous things. And when I get my hands on it... Hey, how about you take a massive chill pill and we find it first? Yes, 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 yes! I'm just getting excited. And as crazy as Aiden's been lately, if he gets that thing, it would be bad. Well, if we beat him to it, he won't be able to get his slimy little hands on the thing. We need to find Aiden. He's got our flint and steel, and he's up to no good. But we're gonna stop him. He mentioned an inn, right? That seems like our best lead for finding Aiden so far. Agreed. The blaze rods already have a head start, so we need to get moving. We don't have any time to lose. Hello! It is nice to meet you! Boy, these are some popular crafting tables. Don't worry, everyone. Your turn will come in time. Please have your materials ready when you approach the crafting table. Uh, I knew I shouldn't have waited so long to eat. This is a long line just to use a crafting table. You're telling me. I'm so hungry I could practically eat my wheat right here. But I won't. I'll be patient and turn it into delicious bread instead. What, uh, what can I do for you? I'm so hungry. Seems pretty inefficient to have everyone sharing one crafting table. Why don't you just build your own? What? Hey, I don't know what your deal is, but I don't want any part of it. Please leave me alone now, thank you. Hey, if you're hungry, you should try this. If you say so, holy handouts! That's incredible! <laughs> do you, uh, do you have any more of that? Sorry, all out. Uh, that's, uh, that's okay. I may just never be happy again until I find more of that cake.
Hey there. Are you on the schedule for the furnace this afternoon? Didn't think there were any more appointments today. Hang on. Let me see here. Dale, 10 stone blocks. Oh yes, that went very well. Melissa, three cooked pork chops. She rescheduled. Classic Mel. Uh, no appointment for me. Thanks. I'm actually looking for the inn. Milo's place, right? It's back there. Right! Milo! Thanks. No building, no crafting, no brewing, no forging, unless with express permission from the founder. All complaints must be registered in person. That's it, you can stop writing now. Intense. Hey, Petra. What you looking at? Just admiring the sights, actually. This place is so cool. I'm not usually one for, like, checking out people's builds or whatever, but even I have to admit, this is really impressive. The founder isn't accepting visitors right now. Captain Reginald, at your service. Hey, so what are you guys up to? Ah, oh, just supervising this citizen while she does her build. The Founder finally approved my petition. The Founder? Well, that's her palace up there. She is the Keeper of the Eversource. Builds everything you see. Some days I can't even fathom how she keeps it all straight. And so this Founder makes all the rules? You got it. She's the one that protects us from the Eversource. Well, it seems only right. That's why she gets to make the calls about what does or doesn't get built. Like my build. It's no easy feat to get all these oak blocks. Your petition was very well handled. Oh, gosh. That's nice of you. I gotta tell you, this founder sounds like a control freak. Control freak? You watch your tongue! Hi. Uh, hello. You know where the inn is? Uh, yeah, I guess so. I don't trust the innkeeper, though. If you really want to find him, his inn's over there. Thanks. I'll leave you to it, then. They just built their way right into town. I, no, I've never seen anything uh, like it. Hello. Oh, oh my. Hello again. Can we uh, do anything for you? You guys seem like you might have the scoop. What's up with the uh, Eversource? Well, um, mm, it, well, it's, it's in the palace. Can you two point me in the direction of the inn? They must be looking for Milo. Shh! Uh, I mean, no, 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 we don't know any Milo. Really? Because it sure sounds like you know him. Uh, okay, okay. We know of him. If you really want to find him. He's the kind of messy looking guy. Spender's always falling down. So messy. Thanks, I guess. Were you two talking about me just now? Um, no, no, uh, of course not. Mm-hmm. 
Please don't hurt us. I'll just leave you guys alone then. Have a nice day. Please stop building, it scares me. What? Nothing. Ooh, we could have almost died just then. Oh, hush. How's it going, Lucas? I'm okay. Just watching these guards. They really mean business. Yeah. I wouldn't mess with them if I were you. Sorry, stranger. Can't come up here. And where should I put them? Yes, just give them here. I'll deal with them. Get out of here. Go, go! Uh, why, hello there. What can I do for you? I'm not sure what the custom is where you come from, but uh, here it is considered impolite to stare. Especially when people are doing boring things not worth staring at, like simply minding their own business next to a wall. Why are you just staring at me? Listen, I don't know who you are, but I don't want anything to do with it. I'm sorry, but I'm actually quite busy. Inns don't keep themselves, you know. Lots of busy work. Okay, seriously, the staring is really starting to weird me out. I'm sorry, but it's like I told those other outsiders. I can't help you. Now, please. Hey, is this our guy? He tell you where to find the blaze rods? How many of you are there? I told you, I don't know anything. He hasn't told you anything yet. Is he hiding them somewhere? Look, I know you talked to them, Milo. Just spill it. Fine, if it will make you leave me alone. That Aiden fellow did come talk to me earlier. Wanted to know where the Eversource was. Called it! I just told him what everyone else already knows. The Eversource is in the palace with the founder. That's all that happened, I swear. What a bunch of creeps. Yes, I wasn't terribly fond of them. So, where is Aiden now? The group left for the palace, and I haven't seen them since. Attention! Attention, everyone! Just a moment of your time, please. Emergency meeting attendance is mandatory. Oh, slime blocks. Curious. I wonder what that's all about. Oh, it's the founder. I wonder what this is all about. Yes, I'm nervous being surrounded by so many people. Guys, I think I found the blaze rods. Oh no. What are they doing? People of Sky City, I'm sorry to pull you from your duties, but something urgent has come to my attention. A crime has been committed. A crime? What kind please, of crime? Please, please remain calm. Earlier today, outsiders built a bridge into our fair city from a distant island. Now, whether these outsiders know it or not, this is a violation of Sky City's most sacred law. No unauthorized building. Wait, is that you? Are you the bridge builders? Obscene the builders! Atrocious! Everyone, everyone, please. I didn't know it was against the law. It was just a bridge. This is nuts! Jesse, wherever you are, step forward now. I have already been informed of your identity. I appreciate that you may be ignorant of our laws, but I will warn you, Sky City is small, and I promise that if you try to hide, I will find you. We need to get to that Eversource at whatever cost. This is clearly our fastest way into the castle. Am I getting arrested? Wait! Don't be fooled by the Founder's lies. I can help you come up with a plan to get into the palace. Here I am! I built the bridge! Are you crazy? Does she look 
like she's gonna help us. Hey! Unhand me! Come with me! This is completely under- Sorry, Ivy. I'm going to go. Me too! Quick, follow me! Wait, wait! I'm hey, coming hey. peacefully! That's them! They're getting away! After them! Jesse, run! Run! Get over there! Come on! Where are you going? <laughs> Just in here, yes. There's nowhere to hide in here. It's a dead end. Before I take you to any further, you must take an oath. I think they went this way. You must swear to never reveal what I'm about to show you. What? Do you swear that? You can't let them get away. Milo, I solemnly swear that I will never tell your secret to anyone else. Fantastic. Philippe? Right this way. This is Build Club. Whoa. Everything you see before you was built from resources that my people have saved or uh, obtained. Man, it can't be easy to come by some of this stuff. Nice work. It can be difficult, it's true. Many items have to be snuck under the noses of guards. Wow, this is quite the secret hideout, Milo. Very nice. <clears throat> it is not a hideout. It is a build club. You see, one day, a long time ago, I was just a citizen of Sky City, like any other. I wanted to make a community garden, so I put in a petition for a dirt block, and mercy me, it was granted. But in my excitement and haste to build my garden, I accidentally dropped my new block, and it fell right over the edge. For my crime, I was tossed into the Founder's Dungeons. And I was in there for a very, very long time. Oh, how I grew to hate that dungeon. Jeez, that seems pretty harsh for such a tiny crime. Oh, but it's not tiny. I was charged with egregious wasting of resources. And in Sky City, that's one of the worst crimes of all. You see, in our world, when something falls over the edge, it is gone, forever. But I have always believed in my heart that just because building is risky, it doesn't mean that no one should do it. If only I had known you were builders sooner, I would have helped you all escape when I first met you, rather than let your friends be taken. But at least you are here, yes? I would like to save Lucas, and Ivor, I guess. Is there anything you can do, Milo? Our friends are in trouble. Yes, I hey, think- Milo! Ah, hello, my friends. Bringing in outsiders? Seriously? Pretty hard to keep this a secret club if you just bring people in. Yeah, we have it hard enough as it is. Everyone, please! Yeah, it's hard enough without you bringing in a couple of randos. Guys, don't worry. We're builders, just like you. Yeah, Jesse's right. Just chill out. We're the ones that built that bridge into town today. What? Dude! Milo, jeez! Milo, are you kidding me? The most wanted criminals in the whole city? We gotta turn them in before the guards break our door down. Well, no, let's not do that. I assure you, harboring them is worth the risk. They are the epitome of Build Club material. Builders, I'm not sure. They say they're builders, I guess. Oh, perhaps a challenge? All right, then. If Milo says you're these amazing builders, prove it. Yeah, build something. Now, see here, this is all highly disrespectful to my guests. I'm the leader here. Hey, Milo said that you guys were going to help us. And they will, I swear. Just please help me appease them. They're nervous. We don't know many recipes, so if you just show us something that they build where you come from, you're gonna be just fine, Jesse. Jesse, it took us many weeks to scrape together this inventory. Please, 
Use them for your build. Okay. Thanks. Let's see what we've got to work with. Anyone got something to take notes with? No. Darn. I guess I'll just have to try to remember all this then. Meh. Boom! Check that out. <laughs> I've seen one of those before. Yes, but we've never been able to figure out how to make one ourselves. Very impressive. Oh, wait a minute. This is called an anvil. It's very useful and impressive. I can understand why the guards are after you. I mean, that was awesome. Right? I told you. Yeah, we're really sorry. Wowzers. So sorry. <sighs> yeah, sorry. we're sorry. Uh, I'm sorry. Okay, awesome. You're all sorry. That's great. But how about we start talking getting into the palace? Ah, yes, of course, of course. That is, after all, why you are here. I must say, though, after seeing you in action, your skills are even more impressive than I could have imagined. So impressive that I wonder if I could implore you for a tiny favor. What kind of favor? I help you get into the palace. You help me steal the Eversource for my people. Unlimited resources for everyone! <laughs> Overwhelmed at the thought. Okay, but my friends are in trouble in there. So if we're breaking into the palace, we're going to save them. This is an acceptable and noble arrangement. Good. Now, as for how to get into the palace, according to my informants, the founder keeps the Eversource behind a secret door located in her throne room. Dramatic. Every night, the Founder leaves guards at every door, but there's a single window at the back of the palace that is left unguarded. It's an almost perfect point of entry, but it is far too high. <laughs> if we can find a way through that window, the Eversource would be practically within our grasp. Okay, so we'll just climb up. That doesn't seem too hard. You have not seen this wall. We have tried, but it is sheer steel blocks. No handholds. It means you guys need to start thinking like builders out there. We're gonna make a ladder. Building ladders? Craft a way in? If you could show us how to craft something that would reach the window, we could get this heist underway. Jesse, we will never forget this day. Okay, my friends. This should take us right into the throne room. Once inside, we will just need to find the secret entrance that the Founder supposedly uses. Isn't it exciting? On our way to changing everything! Freeing the Eversource for the people! Milo, pipe down! There are guards down there! Right, right, right. My apologies. I'm just so excited. Actually, out in the field, applying ladders to a wall! Jesse! Jesse! Petra! 
Boy, am I glad to see you guys. Right back at ya. Lucas, Ivor, we're here to rescue you. I think you're a little late for that. <laughs> yeah, we broke out ourselves. It's a good thing you guys are here. Aiden's going after the Eversource. Which we obviously can't abide. We're here to get it first. Fantastic. That is what we are doing as well. Who, uh, who's this guy, by the way? I mean, I assume he's cool, right? Oh, right. Milo Lucas, Lucas Milo, Milo Ivor, Ivor Milo. He's a new friend. I am charmed. Yeah, yeah. The Founder's secret entrance is supposed to be somewhere in this throne room. If it's in here, we'll find it. I'm getting a very door vibe from this. Yeah. What happened to it? Just need to make something to activate that redstone circuit again. There's gotta be something in here we can use. Like a lever. If you can find one of those bad boys, we'll have that secret door open in a snap! How's it looking? Still looking like it needs power. Don't worry. I'll find the answer. Okay. I believe in you. Definitely regal. Not bad. So, how was prison life? Oh, it was wonderful. I've always wanted time behind bars to work on my poetry. That was sarcasm, in case you were curious. We got in. Yes, I'm very grateful to you for all of your help. Give yourself some credit, Milo. You've done Build Club proud. Huh. I get the feeling this is a special tree. Yes, the ground you're standing on is actually the original island that all of Sky City started from. That tree dropped the saplings that grew into every tree on the island. I may not agree with the Founder's methods, but even I must admit, that's an impressive feat. Wow. That is pretty special. Poor dead bush. Barely more than a bundle of sticks. Lava and water, placed exactly far enough that when they collide, it creates cobblestone! Genius! That is ingenious!
Jesse, what are you doing? <laughs> Sorry. Habits of the Enderman by Soren. Wow, how'd that get here? The rest are just inventory registries and legal information. Boring. anyone not yet but the acoustics are funky in this place so it's hard to tell when people are coming we shouldn't hang around got it uh, what is going on here? if I had a lever this would be the perfect spot for it things for the people. Hopefully no one will miss one dead brush. Perfect. I think that should be everything I need to make a lever now. Okay, let's do this. Ah, my old friend, the lever. Didn't know you were watching. My apologies. It is still just such a thrill to see someone so confident and sure in their building abilities.
these chests. Yeah, and they're all labeled? Creeper, zombie, sheep, pigman. Curious. But what does it mean? Hmm. Eggs? The sign says sheep, not eggs. Might as well throw it and give it a shot? A sheep? Is... is that a monster? That's not so bad. It is fluffy. The eggs all have creatures inside them. And they're all different colors. They must be, you know, color-coded what's in them. So, she can just spawn things whenever she wants to. The Eversource makes these spawn egg things. Stay on your toes! We're close! Ah, I can't wait! <sighs> Let's take a look around. Yes, the spawn eggs. It's so simple. Wait, 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 wait. That's the Eversource? What? So the chicken lays the eggs, and the eggs make monsters, and the loot from the monsters made this place. Well, throw it in the minecart and let's get out of here. We're still taking it, right? The chicken that the entire city depends on? Are you sure that's a good idea? What are you talking about? We need to bring it to the people. With it, we'll finally be free of the Founder! But that clucking thing is what we came for! Milo's right. The Eversource belongs to the people. What? I thought that was the whole point of this adventure! I knew it! I knew you were here to steal from me! She's too fast! Just give me a second to catch my breath. Nothing to say for yourself? It's just like I told you, Founder. They're here to steal the Eversource. Classic Order of the Stone. You don't say. What? No! Don't believe them! Ugh, Aiden, would you just shut up already? You just expect me to believe a bunch of criminals? Aiden warned me that you were a pack of thieves, and here you are, prepared to make off with the one thing our city depends on to survive. Boy, when you put it like that, I almost feel bad. Yep, afraid I'm going to be taking the chicken. It's mine now. What? This is outrageous. Aiden, don't do this. Somebody order eggs.
there being no ground? I had no idea. How... how could I have known? <sighs> this has been down here the whole time. I forbade anyone to look for land below us. It was too dangerous. A, a lost cause. Well, land is gonna be a pretty big game changer for you guys. I mean, it's going to change everything. Yes. It's all just so enormous. Just, just grass everywhere. I can barely process what I'm seeing. What, what do I do now? Once my people see this, I... I have a lot of planning to do. First things first, we're gonna go back up there and kick Aiden's butt. Getting back up? My word, you're right. We need to do that. I hadn't even thought that far ahead yet. Jesse, look out! Uh. What's going on up there? It's definitely a bad sign. Your city's probably in big trouble right now. I can't leave my subjects in whatever trouble they're in. Jesse, will you please help me get back to Sky City? Stop Aiden. My poor subjects. This is terrible. Of course, I'll help you. You're the founder. Thank you, Jesse. And please, call me Isa. Okay, getting back up. Getting back up. Let me see what we've got to work with. Hmm. That'll work. What is it? Jesse, we need to start gathering dirt. As much as we can. Uh, how will that help? We're going to build a tower of dirt all the way back up to Sky City. Grab as much dirt as you can carry. should do it. Jesse, what is that? Uh, what? What is it? We 
got a city to save. Ready? I believe so. And when I get up there, I'm going to tear those blaze rods limb from limb. under attack by monsters, ma'am. Everywhere. They seem to be coming from inside the palace itself. Aiden! Come on! We need to stop him! I'm sorry, Jesse, but I have to save my people. Take care of yourself out there, okay? And to you as well. Jess! You're alive! Please, can you help us? Hang tight, Milo! quick on your feet. But with all seriousness, how are you alive? I saw you go over the edge. Quick version, you know how you all thought there was nothing but void below you? Yes. Yeah, that was wrong. There's land. You speak truthfully, my friend? No. Well, I can't wait to hear all about it later. I gotta get to the palace. Thank you, my friend. We'll see you on the other side. Taking over the palace. He's holed up in the throne room, throwing those spawn eggs everywhere. No one can get inside! We need to stop him. I know. Jesse, take one of these. They're all locally sourced and handcrafted. I use only the best ingredients. Got any potions of invisibility? Here! Can't stop what you can't see. Back down and get out of my face, Reggie! You're delusional, Aiden! The people of Sky City will never bow to you! You killed the founder! Yeah? Well, you're gonna be next if you don't shut up! Now you listen here! I'm the captain of the guard! You can't just talk to me that way! I'll talk to you however I want, Reggie! I just... How are you alive? I saw you fall! You went down! You're alive! You're alive! Is the founder with you? I heard... <laughs> what the... Not one more step! I killed you once! I can do it again! Just hand over the chicken, Aiden. Hand it over before I make you hand it over. Just... 
die already! Should've left while you had the chance! Someone else in the spotlight, can you? You just can't let anyone else win. Oh, it just drives you crazy to see someone else succeed, doesn't it? Aiden, look around you. It's over. Give up. No! You don't get to tell me that! You deserve that kind of mercy. No, 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 come on. You can't just leave me behind. If you leave me here, I'll die. I thought you were the good guys. Get moving. You're coming with us. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Jesse. <laughs> <laughs> More than you deserve, frankly. much for the blaze rods. You retrieved the Eversource. Yes, ma'am. Everyone, stay together! Jesse, there you are! Jesse, the situation is getting out of hand. We simply can't stop all the monsters and protect my people. Stay here, the more danger my people will be in. We just need to find a way down safely. The 
waterfalls. The waterfalls can take us to safety. What? Are you crazy? The waterfalls will just take us into the void. We'll die if we fall down there. The void won't kill you. There's land down there. Everyone just watch me and follow my lead, okay? us so far. I will show you just how much I believe in Jesse's word. you enough. You've saved us all. So what do we do now? Everything's just so different and scary. But exciting? What do you do? You go have fun. You guys were cooped up there so long. Now you can do whatever you want. Uh, uh, oh. Freeze, criminals! You're not going anywhere. Those idiots. Now, this is just speculation, but I'm guessing they have some regrets. I knew they wouldn't get away. Aiden. Oh, uh, hi, Jesse. I'm, uh, I'm so sorry. So sorry to cause all that trouble. I can see where it all went wrong. I've uh, got some regrets, to say the least. Please, I really am sorry. I'd say you have a lot to think about. Yeah, yeah, that's for sure. I don't ever want to see you again. Yeah, yeah, don't worry. I think I'm just going to stay here. I'll make a little house, find something constructive to do with all my pent-up anger. You know, like being a writer. I won't try to compete with you anymore. Attention! Attention! Hello, hello everyone, please. This is your founder speaking. Now that we're all safe, we need to organize. Start planning our new community. Are you listening to yourself? That's insane! We were prisoners long enough on that island in the sky! It is time for us to run free! Build whatever we please! Wow! Those two just cannot get along. Jesse, I cannot allow my people to be influenced by this naive idealist. Bah! I'm sure I do look like a naive idealist through the eyes of an oppressive dictator. Hey, both of you! Fighting isn't going to solve anything. It will if I win! Oh, of course you'd think that way. 
No, you don't understand. It will be night soon, and that is when the monsters come out. If we don't prepare, we'll be in danger. You're just making excuses to control our behavior, just like before. We must trust in ourselves, be able to learn from our mistakes. The people need to build! W what do we do? Who are we supposed to listen to? Uh, well, I think you're both right. You don't want to just run around with no plan. But you can't schedule and organize everything either. People need to be free to try new things. But you gotta be safe about it. I suppose I still have much to learn. Thank you, Jesse. I don't understand yet, but I trust you. Well, Jesse, I suppose the era of Sky City is over. We may disagree about how to run this place, but I thank you for everything you have done. I guarantee that we will be telling stories about your visit for many, many years to come. The day that Sky City was liberated. A hero of few words. I can respect this. You know something? She was a little scary at first, but... She's all right. <laughs> I'm gonna miss that crazy guy. I guess we should prepare for Nightfall too. Without another portal, we're stuck here. Been a while since I've had to start from square one. Ugh. Just when I thought my days of punching trees were behind me. Aw, oh, come on, Ivor. It could be fun. What? When I was on the ground with the Founder before, I totally found the portal! And you didn't say anything?! Yeah! I'm actually gonna have to agree with Ivor on this one. Hmm. I guess the moment just never presented itself. Come on! Oh! Hi. Ah, oh, there you are. I'm so sorry about her. That's okay. It looks like she's having fun running around. Yes, I think she took it pretty well when I told her she didn't need to be the Eversource anymore. What are we gonna do with you now, huh? What are you going to do now? Besides continue to be adorable, of course. <laughs> but that was a given. After so long being the Founder and the Eversource, now we can just be Isa and her best friend, Benedict. Ah, uh, that's a boy's name! Huh, what a closed-minded attitude. Jesse, I would be honored if you would take this as a small token of our gratitude. Thank you. Come along, Benedict. We have a lot of adventures ahead of us. Well, there goes the Eversaurs. Off to cluck and peck at seeds for the rest of its valuable life. Hey, Jesse. You okay? Jesse? Oh, I just saw those pigs and, you know. Oh, yes. He would be really happy to know you're still having adventures like this. See? Just like I told you, one portal back home. Whew, what a huge relief. I was worried we'd be stuck here forever. Ugh. I just can't wait to put this whole world behind us. Oh, is someone being grumpy? No, a little. I was just hoping for a real treasure is all. <laughs> Livestock's no proper treasure. Although I wonder what would happen if you put that tiny crown on a different chicken. Come on, guys. Let's go home. Wait till Axel and Olivia hear where we've been. They'll never believe... It. That's not what I was expecting. <laughs>